Hello and welcome to another StarCraft 2 editor tutorial. Um, today I'm going to show you how to create um, dialogues um, and what dialogues are. Um, they're just um, essentially ju they're just uh, heads of display um, uh, you can create in the game and in this heads up display you can create uh, buttons and you can create images and you can create uh, text and all sorts of stuff in them. Um, so yeah, let me just demonstrate this. Um, I've created a button here and uh, when I press this button it's gonna launch an effect on uh, our marine here um, specifically the effect from uh, the campaign uh, the artifact when you launch the artifact um, so this is just uh, what uh, Blizzard had done or what they did to create this effect essentially um, so yeah I think that's why that's um, I think that's what I'm just gonna to show you here. So uh, let's jump into the editor. Oh, sorry, uh, the editor here, and let's create a new map. A melee, uh, heart of the swarm, and just make it fire. Um, let's create a marine. Just place him here and um, we have to go into dependencies and check uh, we have to add the <coughs> have to add the swarm and uh, the swarm campaign the swarm story campaign because um, the effect is only there or is only ava available when you have added the campaign stuff into um, yeah into the, the dependencies um yeah that's basically how our terrain's going to look like um let's go into the trigger editor and delete all this stuff here from uh the melee, melee initialization and let's add uh no let's first um let's create some variables some global ones um let's call this the dialog and make it a type of dialog um, so this is gonna be our background. <coughs> it's gonna be our background. Um, you could also just call it background dialog. Uh, um, and we're also gonna create a dialog. Uh, a button. Let's call. It, let's just call it the button. And make it a type of dialog item. Um, let's go into the media initialization here and create our new dialog here so this is uh, gonna be our um, it's gonna be our heads up display that full screen uh, heads up display um, uh, where you have the button where you have the button in the side here uh, the launch button um, uh, but you can see it you can see the uh, the borders from the beginning so what we're going to do is also just hide those hide the background uh, of the borders it's actually the borders it's uh, it's gonna hide from this dialogue um, and we are gonna show the dialogue as well uh, show last created dialogue and uh, let's set the variable let's set the background dialogue to the last created dialog. So uh, let me create some comments here just to uh, just to structure it or whatever. Um, let's call it the background. And let's make a new comment here. It's gonna uh, call this the button. Uh, and let's go ahead and create a new uh, dialog item. It's gonna be a button a button dialog here, a dialog item, sorry, um, for the last created dialog here. And uh, let's make it the size 300 and 100. Anchor to the right side or left side, uh, as you saw in my map. And the text just kind of uh, right launch here. Uh, that's the text on the on the button as you see or as you saw here um, and let's set 
this to the last uh, created. Set the button here to the last created. Oh, sorry. Uh, last created dialog item. And uh, then we're going to go ahead and create a new trigger. Let's call this uh, launch. And um, the event's going to be a, di a dialog item is used. So whenever we use the um, the button here and make it uh, the used dialog item whenever we uh, whenever we use this button um, it's gonna launch an effect on our marine uh, let's search for effect click on this and execute the I think it's called artifact uh, it's the persistent one uh, that creates this uh, giant uh, energy nova um, and select that and uh, it's gonna be on our marine from player one here um, yeah that's I think essentially that's it um, let's go ahead and test it and see if it works alright uh, the buttons on the center of the screen I think I pressed something wrong I did something wrong uh, but whatever, let's just test it. See if it, yeah, it creates this uh, giant energy nova. So uh, that's essentially how you create a dialog um, dialog item button or uh, just a button uh, in the heads of display. Um, just to show you why we um, why we were hiding this background image of the dialog. If um, if we deleted this and we tested this out our entire screen will be covered up in the, in that dialog um, oh that's why it's not set to full screen yet uh... wait a minute let's create uh, search for full screen set dialog last created dialog to be full screen uh... that's all that also explains why it was uh... The, why the button was in the center so let's test it again Yeah, that's uh, <laughs> that's why you have to um, why you have to hide the background of this uh, this heads up display because <laughs> you'll get this uh, crazy crazy border um, showing up. So yeah, still works though. <laughs> well, so yeah, there you have it. Um, that's how to create dialogue items and uh, just dialogues in general.